Well, before lawmakers come back to work, they are actually laying out their priorities for the 2022 session. Today is the ceremonial kickoff of the year. And our Fox 59 State House reporter, Kristen Escal, she was right in the middle of it all. Kristen, so what is on the agenda that we can look forward to this year? Well, Fanchon, quite a few items the House Speaker laid out today involving several issues, including schools, education, uh, government spending, health care, and giving money back to Hoosier taxpayers, among several other issues. Now, the House Speaker today called on Democrats to work with him and the Republican supermajority to get some of these items done. And today, the House Minority Leader told me he believes there is room for bipartisanship on some of these priorities. With the fall of the gavel, the Indiana legislature kicks off a new session, starting with leadership listing its biggest priorities. House Speaker Todd Houston says education is one area at the top of his agenda, saying lawmakers should take action to improve test scores and make sure parents have a voice over what's taught in schools. A parent's voice must be heard and respected. And we'll ensure that's the case. We're going to expand on what we've done in the past, which is give parental choice more and more. And that's going to filter into their input in school decisions. House Minority Leader Phil Giaquinta says he believes parents should have a voice in schools, but cautions against any push to make school board races partisan. It wasn't that long ago that we decided not to elect a superintendent of public instruction because uh, Republicans wanted to take politics uh, out of the classroom, so to speak. Combating rising health care costs is an item both sides say needs to be a priority, with lawmakers looking at ways to reduce prices across the system. And House leadership wants to find other ways to give money back to Hoosier taxpayers as well. Aside from the automatic $545 million tax refund going out early next year. Whether it's from, uh, as we look at, at some of our spending issues, where we invest our money, etc., I think we have to keep a sharp eye on where, this, where inflation is going. Democrats say they're not opposed to tax cuts as long as they don't hurt certain areas like local governments. Uh, there's other things that we can do with uh, targeted tax cuts uh, just to, to help benefit Hoosiers, then I'm certainly we'll, we'll, we'll take a look at those. And today the House Speaker says he and his caucus members are watching various abortion court cases across the country very closely and say they're ready to take action depending on what the courts decide. But today the House Minority Leader warned that if Republicans do go down that path and pursue abortion restrictions, it could hurt the ability of both parties to work together overall here at the State House this session. For now we're live at the State House, Kristen Escal, Fox 59 News.